this is definitely one of the ones they walk by as well. Oh, she smells good. Like, okay, period. Because I know I do. Do you be my leading lady? I want a contract, get no baby. In the meantime, I go around. In the meantime, I go around. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Robin. If you're new here, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you're not, then welcome back. So today we have a very exciting video. So everybody always asks me like, oh my God, you smell so good. What are you wearing? What is that perfume you got on? And baby, I love the compliment. One thing about me, I love a compliment of somebody saying that you smell good. Cause that's just like one of the biggest compliments that you can get. Like everybody can always say you look pretty, you look good. But if you smell good, that's top tier. So everybody always asks me what are my perfumes. So I have a huge perfume collection and it's still growing every single day and I'm building onto it. But I just want to show y'all everything that I have for right now. Some of my favorites, some of my least favorites, some for the summer, some for the winter. I just have a whole bunch. So we're going to get right started with this video. So let's go. Okay, so I wanted to first start off with my favorite and I'm going to go from the most expensive to the least expensive. So we're going to start off with Perfume de Marley. This is in the scent Delina. Oh my God, y'all. This is a showstopper. When I say it smells so good, it's so classy, it's so elegant. It's like when you walk into the room, you're demanding the room. Anything, anybody that smells you with this on is going to fall in love with you. I get the most compliments off of this. Now this is quite pricey but i got the big bottle they do have smaller bottles and it smells so good um it's a very feminine scent kind of floral and it's just amazing like oh it's almost gone you can't really tell how much you have left but i can kind of feel it that's why i really don't try to use it like that I try to use it on special occasions because this is oh my god y'all have to go get this this is one of the best perfumes in my collections for sure and this one is $400. We're gonna go into, everyone knows what this is. This is Baccarat 540. This is a normal, everyday, still luxurious, luxurious scent. Um, I love this. This is like something that I must have that you have to have in your perfume collection. I feel like this is one of the things that everybody knows what it is, but it still smells luxury, still smells clean. Everybody know how this smells. This is, I think, about $400 too. Um, but I just got this for Christmas, so I really haven't used it like that. This one and Perfume de Marley, I really only use for for special occasions because they are so expensive and I don't want them to run out super, super fast. So everybody knows what the rock rock smell like, but it is one of my favorites. So you have to make sure you have this in your collection, especially as a woman. Okay. So then we're gonna go into my next favorite. This is Lady Million. It's not really focusing, but I love this packaging. Just look at the packaging. It's like a diamond. It's so cute. Now this one, it smells very i forget how they smell sometimes <laughs> this one is a very rich smell um it's very clean cut it's very look luxurious um it's one of them perfumes that you just walk into a room and they're like oh she smells good it's just one of them ones and i got this actually at in aruba leaving aruba and in the airport i got this because they had a sale and i was like let me just go see what perfumes they got so i got this this is lady million a lot of guys were the i think is men million or something like that but the packaging is a1 this is definitely one of my favorites it's another one that i wear on special occasions not as my everyday perfume um another thing i can say is very rich like if you want that rich smell this is to get for sure like if you want the clean rich luxurious smell this is it for sure and i think this one was i got it on duty free so i don't think i spent no more than 200 dollars i'm gonna have the exact prices um for you guys on here but i can't remember the exact price i spent on this but i know it wasn't more than 200 dollars i believe so now we're gonna go into more of a soft, subtle scent. So this is Tiffany Love, scent Love. 
I love this so much. This is considered one of my um, everyday perfumes. This is so light. It smells so good and fresh and clean. One thing I love, I love a really good fresh clean scent perfume. And this is def definitely um, that right here. I think this was 175 or 180 or something like that. Um, of course, I got the bigger bottle. I tried to get the bigger bottle because I just don't feel like going back and forth getting another refill, especially if this is a perfume that I love. So I got the bigger bottle and it smells so good. If you want more of a clean, fresh, more like an everyday perfume, this is definitely the way to go, especially for the summertime. This is amazing for the summer. So for my next clean perfume, um, this is Dolce & Cabana Light Blue. The packaging is really cute. I used to love this perfume. I used to wear it every day, every single day. This is a super light perfume, but at the same time, I do have like a strong undertone to it. So I like it, but I have other perfumes that I like more. So I pick and choose when I wanna wear this, but this is definitely like an everyday scent. Just throwing it on to go to the grocery store or whatever you need to do. This is definitely that right here. Um, I like it. It's not one of my favorites, but I, like I said, I, over the years, I started getting more and more. Okay, sorry, y'all. I got really interrupted by my alarm. <laughs> but, um, this scent is really good for every day. Super light with a hint of, I would say, a little masculine undertone to it. When I first smelled it, I was like, eh, it kind of smell a little masculine rather than feminine. She keeps smelling it more and more. You like it smells really good okay still on the light perfume side this is chanel chance um i really like this perfume this used to be one of my favorites too as you can see i really haven't used a lot of it this is a very strong scent like it's super light but it's very strong and i'm not a person that likes very super strong like harsh type of perfume it smells really good it's very elegant i would say it's very one of them things where it's like oh she smells good but it's definitely strong and you can definitely light up the room in this um i would say i will wear this more on the everyday side or if i'm going to like a date or something more casual than formal i will wear this but it definitely smells really good it wasn't on the expensive side i think this was actually a gift for my birthday though um I'm gonna put the price, but I don't think this was really expensive. And then the packaging is really cute. Everybody should know about the Chanel Chance though. I think everybody knows about Chanel Chance. If you don't, now you do. If you know, you know. Okay, this is a groundbreaker perfume that has shook in the world. Everybody and their mother knows about this perfume. And if you don't have this in your collection, what are you doing? Of course, we're talking about Burberry hair. As you can see, this is basically gone i use this all the time this is one of my favorite 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 perfumes it smells delicious light elegant it is like everything that you want wrapped in one this is definitely a light perfume though you will wear this every day you can wear this to the grocery store you can wear this running errands go to target um you can wear this to Pilates, to the gym. Like something very super light. I wouldn't wear this. Me personally, I probably wouldn't wear this on a date or like going to really a formal event or something during the nighttime because it's such a light scent. It's not really heavy. So I will wear this, as you can see, I wear this all the time during the day. Um, the packaging is really cute. This is def um, definitely one of my favorites. And a couple, probably like less than a month i'm gonna have to re-up on this um i actually want to try the blue the green one my sister has the green one i have the pink one but it smells so good this is like an all-time favorite i think everybody have this and if you don't have it you need to go get it because what are you doing this is this is that girl okay this is definitely one of the ones like walk past like, oh she smells good like okay very because i know i do this is a definitely one of my favorites. This is Meisha Margiela's replica in the scent bubble bath. When I say I get so many compliments on this perfume, when you wanna smell fresh out the shower, smelling like 
Oh, she just woke up. Oh my gosh, she smells so good. Wear this, go get this. I actually got this on a Sephora fragrance sale. As you can see, I really haven't used it like that because I literally just got it. But for what I got, it's actually used a lot. When I say I get my hair done, I am walking around Target. So many of my friends have asked me, what is this scent that you have on? Because it smells so good and so fresh. Like, mm, it literally smells like fresh out of the tub. It's called bubble bath, fresh out of the bath. It is so, oh my God. It gives a fragrance description. It says, comforting clean accords. Comforting clean accords. And that is the best description that it could ever give you for this perfume. Cause it's so comforting. It's a clean cut smell. And it's just amazing. Like one, these are, this is definitely one of the main ones I'm telling y'all to get. Run and get this. They will literally be on you. Cause it's nothing better than a clean perfume. Like, she just smells so clean and fresh. Like, I love those type of perfumes. Cause it's just like, I know you got on perfume, but at the same time, you just smell so clean. Like, you look clean, you smell clean, you look good. Like, everything, this is like the perfect one to go get. I'm telling y'all, please go get this perfume. And it was not expensive at all. Like I said, I got it at Sephora, the Sephora Fragrance Savers event. So I got it for a little bit cheaper, but still, it's not like a super crazy expensive perfume this is the one to go get and i get so many compliments on it i'm telling y'all in the packaging is so cute i love it valentino born in roma this is definitely one of my favorites i've been wanting this for so long i finally got it on christmas i got two perfumes for christmas <laughs> i like perfumes i love perfumes so of course i'm gonna ask for that for christmas but this smells so good it's such a feminine scent actually i would describe this as very feminine i would definitely wear this to um dinner or going out to club or whatever i want to do this is definitely one of them ones it's so sweet it has a sweet undertone to it and i really like that um but it's definitely a nightcap for me I'm trying to get it to focus but yeah it's definitely a nightcap for me the packaging is so cute it definitely runs out a lot i get a lot of compliments when i wear this too so this is definitely one of the ones that you have to go get they sell this in sephora as well um i love this perfume one of my favorites but it runs out very small fast as you can see it's not a lot in the the packaging but it's definitely gonna last you for a minute and the packaging is so cute like <laughs> but this is definitely one of the ones that you're gonna get a lot of compliments on okay y'all so for the next perfume this is ysl mom Perry. um as you can see i use this a lot this is one of the perfumes that is like super strong um it's super strong super elegant if you're really looking for that strong undertone smell to demand the room this is definitely the perfume to get i used to love this perfume i as y'all can see i got so many perfumes this is one of the perfumes that i first got so i kind of abandoned it but it's still a good perfume to get and i really don't think it's that expensive um it's one of the good ones it's just one of the ones to have in your clock in your collection um i love this perfume to this day I just still be forgetting about it because I got so many other ones, but this is definitely a elegant night night perfume. And I think this will be perfect for like a date because it really demands, it really draws him in to really smell you and be like, oh, she smell good. You don't have to be hugging on him. You can just be sitting across the table and be like, oh, she smell good. And this is gonna do it for you, okay? So definitely, definitely have in the collection so the next one that i have is time for soleil blanc this is a it's not a perfume it's a shimmering body oil this is one of them ones where you go on vacation and you want to shimmer it smells so good though it's so light it's you definitely have to put a perfume over this but it smells like vanilla even if you don't want to put a perfume over it it smells so good and like it definitely it just reminds you of the beach like let me show y'all how it looks on the skin if y'all can see that shimmer just look at the shimmer and just imagine that all over your body 
oh my god it smells so good it's shimmery it's hydrated this is definitely one if you travel a lot if you go on vacation a lot this is definitely one of the ones that you have to get and i'm telling you you don't even have to put perfume on it if you don't want to i personally like to put perfume on it on top of it but if you want to just tan on the beach and put this on you oh my god it smells so good i even use it like if i have like my chest out if i'm wearing a nice revealing dress and i have my chest out i want to shimmer and glow a little bit definitely use this amazing so now we're gonna get into the zara perfume collection those were all like name brand um, perfumes so now i'm gonna get into my zara collection because y'all really be sleeping on zara perfumes and they be inexpensive they smell good and they last long so if y'all don't know about Zara perfumes, make sure that y'all go and get y'all some because you missing out, I promise. So this is the one that everybody went crazy over like a year ago. This is Ebony Wood. When I first got this, I loved this perfume, but now that when I smell it more and more, it's just a little too strong for me. It's a very musky scent and a lot of people like musky scents. I personally don't like musky scents like that. It depends on the occasion. Um, but it still smells very good. I don't know if they still sell this at Zara because I know sometimes when they have a perfume collection, they just let it go and they don't re up on it. Um, but this was a collaboration with, I can't remember who it was collab with, but it smells so good. If you love this type of scent, a musky strong, definitely strong scent if you love this, but I personally am not a musky girl. But as you can see, I really didn't use a lot of it. But if you pair it with, I probably, I used to pair it with like, I think Burberry Hair. These two together was a perfect combo for me. So if you play around with your perfumes and pair it well, then this will be a perfect scent for you. And it really wasn't expensive. It went viral on TikTok and YouTube. So that's why it sold out so fast and I was happy I was able to get it, but I really don't use it like that, but it's really, it's a good perfume if you like that type of scent. Another one that I love, OMG, this one smells so good. This is one of my everyday perfumes. Oh my God, this is in Trilli, in Trilli. What did she say? I always can mess up on pronouncing this. And Trinity, and Trinity, New York. And Trinity, whatever it's called. This smells so good. When I say so good, it's so light, it's so fresh. It's fresh and light as well as that sexiness to it. If you really want like a sexy, cute, light perfume, I wear this to Target, I wear this to the movies, I wear this wherever I wanna go. And it smells so good. I really be sleeping on my this one because I got so many others, but I forget about this one all the time. And it lasts so long. A lot of people think that Zara perfume don't last. It lasts, I'm telling you, it lasts you the whole entire day. Just even though that it's cheaper, it still lasts. So, this one right here, I want to see if they still have it because I got this one at probably like the, around the same time I got um, Ebony Woods, but it smells so good, y'all. This is definitely a must-have for me, me personally. Ebony Woods is a more musky scent, and this is a more light, citrus, sexy scent, and this is my type of scent. This is like what I want to smell like all the time. Oh my God. And I get so many compliments when I wear this. We going into the sexy Zara perfume collection. This right here. Oh my God. This is Red Zara's Temptation. I recently just got this. So y'all need to go run and get this. This is the perfect date night going out perfume. When I say this is a sexy spicy beautiful perfume it just hit me with a, a bit of spice oh this is the best perfume that i ever smelled i was in zara shopping and i was like this let me smell some perfumes today i smelled this i got one my friend got one i put all my friends on it they like this is it like this smells so good i always get compliments especially from men 
from with this it's just a very grown sexy scent it's one of them ones where they like oh yeah she knows what she doing when they come to that perfume stuff because this is just so amazing when i say i rave for this anytime i put it on i'm gonna put it on right now even though it's daytime i don't care it smells so good y'all this is one of the best perfumes also inexpensive so make sure y'all go get this it smells so good it still should be in the collection because i literally just bought this probably like a month ago so it still should be in their collection so then i'm gonna go into one that i got off tiktok shop so y'all be sleeping on tiktok shop but they definitely have some gems hidden gems i got this off tiktok shop this is yara the perfume yara um i don't know what the brand is called but the scent is yara this smells so good this is definitely one of the everyday perfumes that i wear all the time i love this perfume it was cheap it was only 50 dollars, and it lasts all day at first when i smelled it i was like eh, i don't know if i like it but then when i started wearing it more and more i fell in love with this perfume so if y'all on tiktok shop i'm pretty sure y'all already heard about this so i was like let me just try it go get this perfume it smells so good you wear it every day it's more on the lighter side rather than the darker sexier side so i would definitely rave for this the packaging is really cute everything is amazing with this perfume so and it was cheap you can never get wrong with cheap perfume that smells good has quality and it lasts so i love this perfume last but not least um my ariana grande i take this on vacation this is cloud i take this on vacation with me this is definitely one of them scents super light super fun if i'm just needing some cute perfume that i don't care about tsa throwing away this is it this is definitely like it kind of reminds you of burberry her so this was like a little like a burberry her dupe ariana grande actually has some really good smelling perfumes and y'all need to go check her out i think it's another one it's like a broken heart it's a pink one it's so cute my friend has that one it smells so good but ariana grande cloud i got this probably like three four years ago and i still got some left so this is definitely one of the ones if you want to go out on some light traveling if you don't want to worry about them throwing away a perfume that you really don't care about because it's not that expensive i think i got this at target um so this is definitely one of them ones i love this yeah and the packaging is super cute it actually came with like a little cloud thing but i lost that so because i didn't have room to keep that but it's really cute okay y'all that is it for my perfume haul i really hope that you guys enjoyed it this is all of my favorite perfumes i'm still building my perfume collection to this day i already got a couple on my list that i already want to go buy but for right now these are some of my favorite perfumes and i really hope that y'all enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe bye